Hi, I'm Ayo Tunde Balogum. Here's your Channels TV Evening News update for February the 4th, 2021. The Inspector General of Police, Mr. Mohamed Adamu, will continue his duty as the nation's police chief despite the completion of his tenure. This is the position of the federal government after President Mohamed Buhari approved the extension of the tenure of the police boss by three months. The Minister of Police Affairs, Mohamed Dingyadi, announced this on Thursday while briefing reporters at the presidential villa in Abuja, the federal capital territory. Staying with appointments, President Mohamed Buhari has nominated the immediate past service chiefs of the nation as non-career ambassadors. The special advisor to the President on media and publicity, Mr. Femi Additional, disclosed this in a statement on Thursday, noting that their names have been forwarded to the Senate for approval. Those nominated include former Chief of Defence Staff, General Abayami Olunishaki, the former Chief of Army Staff, Lieutenant General Tukur Buratai, and the former Chief of Naval Staff, Vice Admiral Ibok Ite Ibas. Others are former Chief of Air Staff, Air Marshal Sadiq Abubakar, and the former Chief of Defense Intelligence, Air Vice Marshal Mohamed Usman. Members of the Senior Staff Association of Nigerian Universities, SANU, and Non-Academic Staff Union of the Universities and Allied Institutions, NASU, have been directed to embark on a nationwide strike from Friday. The directive was issued in a statement signed by the leaders of both university staff associations on Thursday. Representatives of the federal government met with the unions on Tuesday, but the workers said the outcome was not satisfactory enough to assure them that government would meet their demands. On the international scene, Myanmar's generals ordered internet providers to restrict access to Facebook as UN Chief Antonio Guterres said the world must rally to ensure the military coup fails. The Southeast Asian nation was plunged back into direct military rule on Monday as de facto leader Aung San Suu Kyi and other civilian leaders were detained in a series of dawn raids and in the country's brief experiment with democracy. And in sport, Atletico Madrid's new signing Musa Dembele has tested positive for COVID-19 and the club has announced. The squad underwent testing on Wednesday from which Musa Dembele had a positive result for COVID-19 in the PCR test. And that's the news recap. Don't forget to join us tomorrow for the morning update. I'll Sunday, Balogun. Many thanks for watching.